There we go! It's finished! Yes! Oh, now I'm supposed to uh, draw a line. Uh huh. Okay. Oh, okay. I guess you're supposed to uh, draw connections between all the animals. Oh. And the bird. Now on to the next animal. Now we have the uh, animal connection chart here. Oh. No, 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 no. I want to see the chart on the wall. I don't want to see the computer. I want to see the chart on the wall, which tells me how to solve the computer one. Okay, so let me see. Now, this bird is the only one that eats that particular... Okay, so this bird is the only one that eats on that worm. And let me see. It looks like all those creatures are eaten by the coyote. I noticed this game, this is about five times in a row this game has completely, uh... Alright. Is that it? Have I finished all the connections for this animal? Does it eat snails? Here we go. Alright, there we go. This isn't very difficult. Alright. Awesome. And is that it? Did I finish everything? What am I missing? Did I finish all of them? I think I finished all of them. No, I didn't. I forgot to mention that the snail eats plants. Oh. There's another animal I have yet to do. Oh, the bunny eats plants, too. Any more animals I've missed? There we go! I need to restore ecological balance. Oh no, what do I do now? Oh, okay. So for this puzzle, you just need to balance in order to uh, make sure we have the uh, ecosystem correct. You have to make sure we have enough You have to figure out how much of each animal you need in order to make sure that all the animals survive after four years. Okay, now how do you increase this one? Okay, so we're going to need a, uh... We're gonna need a human, two of those... Three of these birds, three of those birds, three of these... Four of them... Four of them... Four, four, five, four, four and four. Is that it? Let's see how that works. Do they do they last for four years? Ah, they don't all last for four years. Those ones die, huh? I think I might have been one off in my assessment. We're gonna need more plants because everybody needs plants. Let's try that one. There we go! There we go. Now everything's back in balance. We have fixed the ecosystem. Well. <coughs> that was kind of a, uh difficult challenge. 
That was really difficult. But on to the next one, the last one, which is the Earth Geology. Which again is nothing but puzzles. Don't worry, pretty soon we're going to get back to, uh, we're going to get back to the exhibits where you actually uh, talk to people and solve puzzles that involve giving things to one person and giving them to another. Alright, so here's what we have to do. We have to put all the continents back in order. Or at least, the order they were in... The order that they were in during this particular time we're aiming for, which is a hundred million years ago? Let me see, this map might help me out a little bit. Okay, so this is what we want to uh, get them to look like. Alright, so they were formed in a supercontinent called Pangaea. That's uh, Greek for uh, all... It's Greek for all the land. So I guess it means all the land uh, stuck together. And I've already forgotten how all the continents go. Way to go, Michael! Nice. Here we go, we got those two connected, and does this go here? I've already forgotten. Let me look at that one more time. Red, that, and then that. Good. Got the uh, big continent of uh, Russia, I believe it is. Most of Asia, actually. Oh, hold on here. Come on, drop it, drop it. Ah, oh, my mouse, my uh, mouse is getting stuck again. Went here. And there we go. Oh, it's 180 million years ago. And as you can see, the Earth has changed. All the continents move. Wait a minute, mountains? Well, now we have to check out these mountains. This is a simple puzzle. You want to get the mountains to look uh, like they do in the uh, upper, le upper left, not upper left, upper right hand corner. Come on, let's look at those mountains. I think all you have to do is move them all up as high as you can. to uh, simulate the movement of uh, the plates underneath the earth as they move, it pushes up the mountains. There you go. And now we have volcanoes as well. Now this is a simple puzzle. We just have to... Uh, make the volcano explode. Fancy graphics. Alright, there we go. We just finished the geology hall. That's good. Alright. Alright, I'm really zooming through this game. Only one hall left, and that's just the world history. And I think pretty much all of them are things where you have to talk and interact with people. Except for this one, the Industrial Revolution. So I'm going to get that one done first. This one is just, as we've seen before, it's putting things together. And of course we're going to be putting together various uh, blueprints. Blueprints for all these various inventions that were... Um, 
invented <laughs> during the Industrial Revolution. 